Avengers 3. Morpheus Entertainment. Yo, Morpheus here today with a BG video. I got a request on YouTube and someone asked me in this request like show me your talents, build, whatever, show me everything you got and explain us how you do a BG. Now I have a ultimate RBG guide which explains the different roles we can do which is a single target burst, multi target burst, base defender, sustained DPS, base defender, uh, tank even, flag carrier, so we have a different uh, kind of different roles that we can fulfill. fulfill. And uh, in this video, I will just show you the one-shot build that I normally use for BGs because I probably think that that's the one you also want to know more about how I do this. Well, first of all, let's go to my gear. Okay, I have double DPS trinket. That's really important. I have so I will just quickly go over my items so you can see my gems. It's like intellect mastery right now. Intellect, intellect mastery. Also the enchants, yeah you can just pause this video and check it again. So you can copy it or you can go to my army, armory link and uh, check it out. Uh, I'm gonna take a soul stone on me and I'm also gonna take this. This is also nice to use, flask of the warm, warm sun. Uh, it's here somewhere, let me check it. Here, it gives you 1000 extra intellect for one hour. I also have these, potion of the jade serpent which gives you 4000 intellect for 25 seconds. And then, um, if you go to my macro, this is my one shot macro for the BG. I use my potion, I use my call sequence, Imswarm, Grim of Felgard, and Emulation Aura. So I have to click this three times and then it bursts. Uses my trinket and everything. I will link this also in the video description. Then quickly go over my talents Dark Regeneration, nice for heal. Mortal Coil, it's just nice to have, but you can switch it to, Mortal, uh, to Sh Shadow Fury. I take Dark Bargain because if you are bursting in a group of 8 people, they will start bursting you. The only way to survive then is to, is to Dark Bargain. You will probably die after it, but you can still kill a lot of people before you die. Unbound Will, just get out of CC because I don't have any CC getting out of CC thingy, you know, trinket. Grim of Service is the best for burst. Then take Double Felguard for most AoE burst. Uh, it's, just, it's just lovely. And you have two stuns, which are also delicious, as you can imagine. Um, so yeah, uh, anything else? Yeah, Manor of Fury increases your AoE burst a lot, so that's definitely a recommended thing to take. Um, if you want to go for more single target burst, or you want to burst two times in a, a you know every minute basically, then you can take Archimonde's Darkness. With Manor of Fury, really, that's what I use when I'm bursting like eight different people at the same time, because you would just does a lot more damage, you know, it, it hits for quite hard. Uh, Mineral Fury also increases the damage of your Hellfire, Emulation Aura in Metamorphosis Fury. Um, I mean, um, uh, fucking hell, Metamorphosis. So, it hits quite hard, and AoE wise, it's just perfect. So, it's really recommended that you take this one. Uh, fearing this guy, he's dead. So, I'm just building up, this is generally what I do, I just go with the flow. Build up some de uh, demonic fury, and then when I'm ready, like now, then I can burst. I mean, my trinket here is off cooldown, so it will pop really soon if I do d do damage. And then I generally want to wait for a big crowd of people. Okay, I don't see a big cr crowd yet, but I, if I look behind me, there are some people coming. Actually, this is also a, this crowd is also big enough actually to burst. And this is our flag carrier, so I should really burst him, but he's already dying, so never mind. Let's go on this guy, this DK. Let's just go instantly on him. Okay, I activate my burst. I have to pop it two times. Okay, now this hunter here. He's dead. Now this guy. Okay, can I kill him? Yeah, now this mage. He vanished on me. Now this DK behind the thingy. Or no, it's a, it's a Shadow Priest when I'm talking about DK. Oh yeah, I bargained. He's dead, he's dead. Okay, so that's how you kill a lot of people in a short period of time. Basically. So yeah, you saw it, it was quite effective and the, the everything helps, you know, it's it's manner of fury, it's it's popping your emulation aura, 
And it's all in the macro, you just have to spam the macro three times and you activate your one shot. And then you can just start spamming Chaos Bolt and Touch of Chaos uh, to destroy everything around you. Uh, the, you know, it's maybe a bit more difficult to survive and to um, CC in, in the meantime. You know, do everything properly. Taking the right target also helps because if you take you know a healer that can absorb a lot of damage then your your burst is kinda wasted I mean it feels like your burst is wasted what you can also do is something else I do often is wait for the damage buff get the damage buff uh, berserker and you do even more damage and that's just lovely for video montages as you can uh, can understand like Morpheus 1 with all the one shots like all the one shots were with berserker uh, buff you know, so that's why my damage was so insane. I mean, Demologs don't usually do 195k crit on a warrior twice in a row. That's just because of Berserk above him. And, uh, and also Jade, Jade Serpent, Potion of the Jade Serpent and Flask of the Warm Sun. Is the damage buff here? No, he, it isn't yet. But it will be soon, probably, I think, in the next minute or so. Uh, he's gonna take the damage buff over there, so... I don't want to lose my Demonic Fury, so I go to the group again. And um, yeah, do some dots on them, spam some uh, fell flames, because you really don't want to lose your demonic fury. I mean, just a pity, you know. You want to keep it as high as possible, so you can burst instantly and don't have to build up demonic fury when you want to burst. Uh, but yeah, I also want to get the damage buff. So let's just check out. I think he might be. No, I want to burst for you guys once with the damage buff. So I quickly check if it's there again, then I go back to their uh, base or whatever, and we're winning so hard. We're not even trying. I mean, I'm not even trying, the other guy probably are. Okay, so here's the damage buff, let's take it. Let's mount up again on this beautiful horse, oh yeah. Now we just have to find a group of people that will die really fast. And then we need to burst on a target like this. Who pretty you know who dies pretty fast. Don't go on monks. I hate going on monks. There are only two people here. That's actually not enough. I want more. Or I just want to solo them. I don't know. I want to do something. Ah, God, this is really annoying though. Ah, oh, silence. I'm getting a lot of damage. They burst on me at the moment. Okay, now this warrior is here. I have to burst now because otherwise I will die. Now this guy. Okay, he's also dead. And that guy is also dead. Yeah, I wanted to do it on a group. But yeah, if you get bursted by a Shadow Priest with probably three orbs or something. And a mage who is helping him. Or, I don't know what was on me anymore, but the, I got some crazy damage. So then you just have to burst. Or you can just die and... Uh, you know, wait for another moment. But since I had the damage buff, I was like, mm, who cares, let's just burst. Actually, I could take another damage buff over there. So let's uh, mount up. Of course, it takes always way too long for you to mount up. Let's go. Ah, we win. It's that easy. It's that easy. So I hope this kind of helps. It's kind of a short video. But it shows you the, 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 the spec, just pause the video anytime you want, check my build, go to my armory, I will post um, the macro in there and also my add-ons, that always helps. And I think you should be able to copy this, I mean, I think, you know. But yeah, see you guys and uh, yeah, till the next video, Morpheus out.